Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm Ms. Roxanada's Daily Rambles. Today we are doing Arrow once again, and we're doing the Season 2 episode, City of Bones. So we start off with Blood gets to be mayor, slash there's a funeral scene for a mortal queen who died in the previous episode. And Oliver's not there, and um, then Blood gives his condolences after the funeral, and Isabel's alive and actually went to the funeral and pretty much um, insults the shit out of everybody. And yeah, so that's kind of crazy. Then, um, then Thea gets really mad at Oliver because of Slade. And then we have a flashback scene where um, they get into the, uh, the Japanese sub that had the mirror crew in it. And then go back to present day where Laurel does not trust blood still. And then um, they find the press release, and uh, they find out the um, the um, was press release was done two days prior to the death of Mario Crane. So that's kind of some damning element um, evidence right there. And they have Felicity just babbling away at um, Argus because they're trying to find Oliver, and it's like. It's a bunch of neat comedy in these type of shows, so I really like that. And it was, of course, it was like, so, ooh, this is a new version of this this processor. It's like, oh, can I feel it? Am I allowed to touch it? Can I touch it? <laughs> this is, and they started babbling. Then Amanda Waller um, comes in and says, um, Oliver has a second layer. So <laughs> so they go to go um, get that. Go, they, so they find the location. They go to find him. And they have a flashback scene where the sub is working, but it's stuck. So they're trying to figure out how to get the sub on um, stuck, basically, obviously. And then we go back to present day where they find Oliver, and Oliver is planning to sacrifice himself. And so then Oliver goes back to the house and talks to Sophia, and it's just says like, "I love you, sister," and whatever happens, just remember I always love you. And um, then we go to the flashback scene where this guy Peter sacrifices himself because he has um, a bunch of radiation poisoning and he's dying anyway. So um, that he has to operate the man-made torpedo. It's like a kamikaze torpedo. And then we go back to the present day. Um, so we go back to the present day where Oliver is talking on the pier. And he gets trained because he was trying to give himself give himself up to um, Slade, but he gets trained. But it wasn't by Slade; it was by Diggle. Diggle trained him. And now, uh, when he wakes up, he sees Laurel in the um, Arrow Cave, and she uh, actually talks sense to him, and she tells him about blood, and then um, so Laurel doesn't trust him, so. Then we go back to the uh, the flashback where uh, the sub gets unstuck, the trick worked, and then we go to the present where Oliver confronts Blood in broad daylight. Um, actually, is actually is at a restaurant, and he um, sits with them at this fancy restaurant and um, basically lays it all out on the lines on the arrow. He's like, Blood's like, what? And then he's. You know, he's being a little smudged, like, you're not going to do anything in this restaurant in public, you being you, or otherwise everyone's going to know you're sick or whatever. And then, um, so then Diggle, then we kind of Diggle gets answers, and, um, and then he gets, um, he connects somebody and gets answers, and Felicity is, she calls herself bitch with Wi-Fi, because the guy calls her a bitch for, um, basically, uh, donating all of this money that's, that they cash her to charity. And then it starts to tap into all this um, other financial stuff for like his parents and stuff. And she goes, and the guy goes like, you're a bitch. And he's like, a bitch with Wi-Fi. <laughs> and then we cut to where um, Thea is leaving town. And um, then we cut to Laurel wants to help the um, team area, but she doesn't really know how. So, they're, um... so then we cut to where... Um, so where they're planting, um, Slade and company are planting people everywhere. And then, then Laurel helps Oliver. Then Dick gets knocked out. 
And then, um, Dick, okay, so get, Diggle gets knocked out literally by Isabel, and she wants to go after Felicity, too, and Felicity hits her with her car, with the van, and then uh, they detonate the, the charge. There's a plant and bombs all around the city, too. Um, they find out all the people are in the um, sewer system or in, in the lower levels, so they want to cave them in. So, um, so Laura goes to help him, and, but the Oliver, um, so Oliver and Laurel cave themselves in. Then we have the flashback scene where they get in control of the sub. And then we'll go back to present day where the undertaking starts. So like I said, it's been it's a really good episode. I like the direction they're going in. Everything's going so well. And it's very suspenseful. And I love the funny moments where, you know, the bitch with Wi-Fi, then Felicity hit Isabel with a car and stuff. I just love that. It's so funny. And um, I pretty much don't have a lot to say, to be quite honest. Um, everything is just so good about it. All the character developments are really great. And just everything about this show is so freaking awesome. So um, another A-plus episode, and that's it for me. So if y'all will comment and like and subscribe, that would be most appreciative because that helps me out. And I know it's since all the time, but I really do appreciate it. And I do read all the comments. So, yeah. I want y'all to have a super awesome day. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye, everybody.